And me personally, I believe that Anne Stage and Winfred William has no journalistic integrity. Yes, so... Earlier on today, I I wrote a post um, on on Facebook, and the post was regarding on stage and Winford Williams, right? I personally. think that on stage is one of the worst thing ever happened to dance on a reggae. Uh, believe me, I do believe that on stage is one of the worst thing ever happened to dance on a reggae. I mean, there's so much talented artists and musicians right in jamaica for on stage to promoting certain behavior on the show right um so i wrote today that on stage is the worst thing ever 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 happened to dance on and reggae and i believe that on stage is actually um, hurting our culture than actually promoting the culture, right? And someone from on stage page, I don't know if it's I don't know if it's um Winfred William respond because I said in the post that. Um, there's a lot of talent in Jamaica that they refuse to give the platform, you know? And Anne Stage replied back to my post and said, and saying that, what talent? Show them what talent, as if Anne Stage is saying to me today in my post that there's no other talent in Jamaica, so what they bring is the talent. That is embarrassing. And me personally, I believe that on stage and Winfred William has no journalistic integrity. For, for you to say to me, give you names or a list of talented artists in Jamaica, you have no journalistic integrity. So if you can find all of these negative um, content and put on the show, it's the same way you can find talented um, artists in Jamaica. So I'm very, me personally, very upset and dis disgusting by, by what I saw on stage is promoting and if sponsor and corporate jamaica are sponsoring that show and running commercial in that show they also are an embarrassment you know people said to me hey kemar why didn't you reach out reach out to winford william and on stage and have, and let him know how you feel and all of that you know, there's several times I reach out to to on stage to first to talk about um, some very important, um, you know, issues that are affecting dancehall and reggae music and the industry, and they declined. They said they're not interested in those things. So to put that out there, yeah, as an elite pro music producer from Jamaica, I reach out to them to say, hey, there are things that need to be said, and there's a lot of people who come on the show who promote. You know, things are say things that is not accurate and you guys need to put people on the show who knows the who know the business and can also 
educate the Jamaica music industry because most of the people that are in Jamaica, they just love the hype and like the hype, but they don't know how the industry run. So it's very disgusting to see what on stage is promoting, and I'm and I'm serious about it, and it hurt me to 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 see that content because uh, on stage, you know, what I know about on stage before the internet, you know, and all of that. I mean, I, it 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 do contribute to reggae and dancehall, you know, in the early stage of on stage, you know where they went for the travel around the world with musicians and stuff like that and artists and come back and hear these shows in Jamaica and artists will see what it look like when artists go there on tour. You know, that's what we know on stage four, right? So I did have, you know, a lot of respect for the show and a lot of respect for um, Mr. Winford William. But what what I see he's promoting now and what he's doing to the culture is embarrassing. And I don't believe that you have any journalistic integrity. And it's sad. It's sad. You can go over Facebook and you can see it. The comment, the comments from Anne State saying to me that pretty much there's no more talent in Jamaica. So therefore, what they bring, that's a talent. And it's a shame. For them to respond to me or respond to my post when I said there is so many talented artists in Jamaica who would like to be on the platform to showcase their talent to the world. And and stayed reply back and said, show me the talent, give me the names. Embarrassing. It should not be about likes, comments and view. You know? There should be a lot more to it. We need to preserve reggae music and dancehall music. I know, every, I know everybody wants to make money. Everybody wants to eat food. Everybody wants to hustle. We, all, we understand that. But there still need to be, you know, a standard. There still need to be um, respect for the, for the genre and respect for the culture. There's some things I believe should 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 remain online because I I don't want, I'm not trying to step on anyone foot or trying to tear anyone down. That's not my mission. But some things that some behavior should just stay on the internet and not on a program like on stage. I don't believe that, you know. So Winford Williams on stage. You should take a step back and rethink on what you are promoting. Trust me, because a lot of the things that you promote, you make a lot of artists believe that they have to break the law. They have to do some stupid, stupid thing for them to get on the show, right? So if you're talented and you call on stage, they will not put you on the show. But if you're a scammer or you box down somebody or you shoot somebody or you're wanted by the cops or something, that's what they want to put on the show. So, it is very sad. Very sad. And this one, this, this is for on stage and nothing, nothing is, and I'm not trying to, disrespect you in no way it may sound you know harsh and all of that but i'm not trying to disrespect you it just hurt me you know as a music producer you know i elite want to hurt me to see what you're promoting and the platform is a huge platform right where i'm international and a lot of people international who i know you know who are not for who are not um, a part of our culture, you know, but they watch it and they are disgusted by it too as well. Because people are watching, Mr. Williams. A lot of people are watching and everyone deserves the opportunity. But 
what you're promoting is not talent and it's not it's not contributing to the industry and you should fix that you should fix that because you have the power to do that and if you don't i will continue to speak out against the hypocrisy right and again i personally believe that you your journalistic behavior is not good right so no disrespect bossy fix it or else you should just turn the light off all right 